Today at the Vermont Institute of Natural Science, interns Alia and Lauren are treating an eastern screech owl. This owl came in on Thanksgiving Day. Uh, some people were returning to their home in Rutland and driving into their driveway and this bird flew right into their car. And unfortunately he suffered a fractured wing uh, when he hit the car. Um, and he's got some head trauma as well. Um, he's really kind of dopey and out of it. Um, and he's been here since Thursday and he hasn't eaten on his own. We've been offering him food and he hasn't eaten. So what we're doing now is stuffing him with uh, small pieces of mouse um, to make sure that his weight doesn't drop and that he can keep his energy up. He came in uh, pretty plump, so he uh, doesn't have any severe weight issues right now but we want to make sure that he maintains a healthy weight. So what Allie is doing is taking little pieces of mouse using hemostats and just putting him right down his throat. Um, owls don't have a gag reflex like humans do so it's not um, uncomfortable for him to have the food go right down his throat like that. And believe it or not this is a full-grown screech owl. This is not a baby. Uh, this is as large as they get. Uh, in the wild and he is gray to help him blend in with bark on trees. So Alia finished stuffing the bird with food and um, you can see his eyes are closed. He's really squinty uh, and that's a sign of head trauma. He's just, his head just doesn't feel so good. And he is on pain medication. And you will see he's also got a wrap around his broken wing um, to help keep the bones in place while they heal. So for now we're going to put him back in his enclosure and we'll check on him at noon. Hi, I'm Megan from the Vermont Institute of Natural Science. What you have just seen is one example of the more than 400 birds that Vince cares for each year. As a 501c3 not-for-profit organization, we depend on your support to provide the medical treatment these birds require to get them healthy and back into the wild. In addition to our on-site avian rehabilitation facility, the Vins Nature Center in Queechee, Vermont proudly displays an impressive collection of live raptors, songbirds, and other animals for you to see up close. With 47 acres of diverse natural habitat, the Vins Nature Center offers a host of educational programs and special events enjoyable for people of all ages. For the latest information on the birds in our care, a list of our current Nature Center programs, outreach opportunities, and events, or to contribute to Vins so that we can continue our important work, please visit our website at vinsweb.org or call 802-359-5000 for more information.